picking what to wear to a ballet performance can be cumbersome, especially if it's your first time. Let us help you dress confidently before you attend. A matinee show is more casual than an evening performance. Afternoon affairs may call for business casual attire, while evening performances may require cocktail or formal looks. For less formal afternoon performances, women have the option to choose dressy slacks and a blouse. The key is to punch it up a little bit with more elaborate accessories or unique silhouettes than what you typically wear to the office. Here Andrea is wearing a crisp Brunello Cuccinelli button-down shirt with Monili details in the collar, waist bag, bracelet, and shoe. Her trousers are by the row and are simple, but the silhouette and lightweight wool material make it special. Greg is also doing an updated business casual monochromatic look. When dressing for the ballet as a man, create a blazer, shirt, and pants combination, and it's always appropriate. This clothing combination can be dressed up or down depending on the formality of the performance and is a great place to start. Ladies, you can also consider an updated version of the little black dress concept. Choose a non-black neutral color like this Nanushka navy blue dress, but amp up the volume with a satin or silk material versus cotton or wool. It's still conservative for a daytime look, but it makes it a little bit more special. Add some simple, elegant jewelry from Logan Hollowell or Shahara, and a coordinating pair of heels from Stuart Weitzman in a Valentino bag to complete the look. Guys, it's not necessary that you wear a sport coat. Pairing an etro polo with a modern slack and her mini jildos and the shoes. The pattern play of the polo and tennis shoes make this particular look more elevated than your traditional polo slack combination for the ballet versus the office. This subtle coordination of colors between you and your partner makes you the picture perfect pair for your first time at the Sunday matinee. Ladies, still want to wear pants but feel a little more dressed up than the first, more conservative look? Consider a coordinating top and pant combination. Again, the silhouette is classic and comfortable, but the satin material of this Nanushka look adds a bit of drama and elegance. Keep the rest of this look simple by pulling your hair back and adding classic jewelry and accessories. Open-toed shoes are appropriate for this daytime affair, and it could be fun to coordinate your bag with your partner's look. Guys, feel free to try another take on the blazer, trouser, and button-up shirt combination, but add some playfulness with a pattern in your shirt. The taboo tennis shoes add a more casual feel to this classic look, and wearing navy instead of black makes it a little less formal and definitely daytime appropriate. Finally, you can opt for a more elevated look by wearing black and white. The difference, however, is how you take this more traditional nighttime color combo and make it daytime or afternoon appropriate. This Zimmerman dress on Andrea is still playful and fresh for spring and summer due to the polka dot pattern and lightweight material. Keeping the shoes and bag in black keeps the focus on the dress and makes it look more subtle for daytime. A black blazer and trouser combination on a man is typically more formal, but adding this white t-shirt in its place and a black Common Projects tennis shoe instantly brings this look back to an afternoon appropriate vibe. The white t-shirt color plays off his partner's polka dots. Overall, any outfit that you would wear to a job interview, nice dinner out, or to a religious service is suitable for a ballet. That might be a simple dress, a pair of chinos or dress pants with a dress shirt, or slacks and a polo shirt or blouse in the spring and summer. Enjoy your Sunday matinee ballet experience in style. Still unsure? Contact one of our expert personal shoppers to help you look your best.